love and happiness Yeah Something that can make you do wrong Make you do right Yeah Love Yo, what's happening, everybody? <laughs> so this is a response to Love Fest 08, Project Love, by one of my favorite people who I'm subscribed to, J. Allen285. So, J. Allen, um, shout out to you. Love Fest, man. I think it's a wonderful challenge, and I think it's a great thing to talk about what we love. So I think for those of you who kind of know me, um, no, one, I love God. Love God. In love with God, kind of, you know, not kind of, I am. And I love God for multiple reasons. One, because one, he first loved me. Number two, because he keeps blessing me regardless of what I do. And I do a lot of wrong stuff. A lot of wrong stuff. Hair. <laughs> I have hair now. I love it. But no, seriously, the um, under guy comes my mother. My mom has been everything, a provider, a friend, a person who understands um, unconditional love. I have people who have um, possibly been through some of the things that I've been through and with their parents, they have not been able to receive the same kind of love that my mom has given me. And um, just the thought of my mom makes me smile and how much she loves me and um, how much I know that her love is unconditional for me. So the next kind of love is for my um, family. And family is funny. <laughs> you don't choose them. If I could choose my family. <laughs> no, no, seriousness. Um, my family is um, like any other dysfunctional family. You know, we have our ups and downs. But moreover, I can say that I know they love me. And they know that I love them. There is nothing that we won't do for each other. So I love my family, despite our differences, despite what we may agree to disagree about. My family's all right with me. They're crazy, they fun, they ghetto, they country. Sometimes all of that mixed in one. But it's my family, so hey, love y'all, if y'all watching. And then I have my last category, friends. Who well, Diddy said, friends, how many of us have them? Friends, something, 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 I don't know all the words, but... Regardless of that, I have some great friends. Um, I love them dearly. I may not act like it. I may sometimes be the worst kind of friend. I'm not good with telecommunications. I'm not good necessarily just, I'm not the best. Like I could be a great person, but I don't know if I'm always the best friend. But I love my friends. Like, I don't wanna say their names on YouTube, but like, a very good friend of mine. We've been friends since we've been nine years old. I'm going to send him this video. He's my minister of music. Then I have my best friend who now works in Nashville, Tennessee. Then I have a very good friend in Atlanta who moved here from Dallas. And I have a very good friend who lives in South Carolina who used to live in Atlanta. A very, very good friend of mine. And I'm talking about these are people who have at some point made a sacrifice for me in something. You know, I just love them dearly. Um, they're the kind of friends where they exceed friendship and they go into family. Um, yeah, my friends. I love them. Then there's this mankind love. Like, love for all mankind. Like I'm, <laughs> I'm a loving person and I can't, like, not love people. And I guess that comes from my background and my raising in church, knowing that God wants us to love one another as we love ourselves. And how can we love him who we've never seen but not love our neighbor? And I guess that's it. Like, that's my love fest. That's who I love, which is, like, everybody. <laughs> um, hope you guys love as many people as I love because I love everybody. Two people who have subscribed to me, I love you. To those who are watching, even if you hate him, love you back. Ah, <laughs> and that's about it. 
Talk to you guys later. Deuces.